Hi, it's Robert Murray. Welcome to this week's Leadership Minute. Uh, I'm going to go down the path of strategy with you this week. And it's something that's been coming up in a lot of the strategy sessions that I've been doing lately, especially when I do the discovery part of strategy, which is sort of pre-strategy session, where I talk to as many people as I can about the organization. Uh, I'll talk to uh, the strategy team, the team of people who are actually going to be involved in doing the strategy. I will talk to other employees within the organization, vendors, suppliers, and customers. What I find fascinating is when I get to the whole part about strategic positioning or as what I call secret sauce, why do customers buy from you and why is it that either what is that that something that you do that's different than your competitors? So here's the thing I find fascinating is that if you boil down all of the value that a customer uh, can choose you versus your competitors on, it all comes down to four things. It's either you have the very best customer service or the best relationship with a customer. You have the very best quality. You have the very, the very best efficiency or you have the very best innovation. And when I ask customers to rank their order of preference, they're able to very, very specifically and very quickly able to say, I choose them because of this, then this, then number three, then number four. Remember, service, quality, efficiency, innovation. No particular order, but the customers are very specific about it. So if I interview 10 customers, nine of them will say, I choose this customer because, or this, this partner, this vendor, because of their quality. They're very specific. Then when I go back inside the organization and I ask the exact same question, I get it, it's all over the map. So finance department will typically say that, um, I think customers choose us because we're efficient. And the engineering department will say, I think customers choose us because we are innovative. Sales and marketing will say, customers choose us because we excel in service. And the operations team will say, it's because of our quality. So it's all over the map. Here's the thing. Talk to your customers. Find out why customers buy from you. So in other words, what is your secret sauce? Then make sure that everybody on the team, all the departments, the entire organization knows that this is our secret sauce. And let's say it's quality. That's why customers buy from you. Make sure that everyone knows that this is the number one reason why customers choose us. We still have to be good at the other three, but this is what makes us different than our competitors. Then you'll start to see that the teams will start to work together and make sure that there's uh, you know, common objectives around delivering that quality. So do your work, talk to your customers, talk to vendors, talk to suppliers, then make sure you've got total alignment inside the organization. That's it for this week. Keep sending me those questions because that's what generates this blog. Take care.